I wish you health, dear Ukrainians. A brief report for the day of September 7th. I congratulated our intelligence officers, our heroes, on the day of military intelligence of Ukraine. We all realize how cool our intelligence officers are. True bravery, powerful results. I thank the main directorate of intelligence on behalf of the whole of Ukraine. On September 7th, I officially introduced the new Minister of Defense of Ukraine, Rustam Umero. He is a strong person a systemic person. He has a good understanding of the defense sector. From the first days of the full-scale war, he has been involved in negotiations on weapons for Ukraine, very sensitive negotiations, productive. He is also engaged in negotiations on the release of our people from Russian captivity. Rustam also has important results for Ukraine in this regard. He can reboot the work of the Ministry of Defense. This is exactly what is needed now. International talks include a conversation with British Prime Minister Sun and Israeli Prime Minister Netanyahu. Of course, the main topic is security. I held several important meetings on our international work. This September, we have to achieve several very specific results in our work with partners. This includes new weapons for Ukraine. We are preparing the news and our diplomatic efforts to unite even more countries to restore peace on our entire land. We are preparing more global pressure on Russia. And our warriors, the National Guard, the 12th Special Purpose Brigade, fighting in the east of our country, as well as the 3rd and 15th brigades of the National Guard fighting in the southern areas. I thank you, warriors, for the very, very effective destruction of the occupiers. The results are what Ukraine needs from everyone right now, at all levels, from everyone who is fighting for Ukraine, who is working for Ukraine, who is supporting us in the world. Glory to all those who bring our common victory closer with their personal results. Glory to Ukraine.